Hey guys, welcome to another video. I am back finally after a about a week or a little bit after more than a week maybe, but a little bit more than a week of not recording because I was busy. So right now we can see here we're playing Skyblock Survival. This is a really old map, um, but many of you guys have been requesting that I play it. Um, so yeah, that's why I have opened it up and I'm going to start a mini series on it. I'm going to try to com complete all the challenges on here. Um, go to link will be in the description below. And just scroll down to where it says um, Skyblock version 2.1 or whatever. It said view challenges. I'll have all the challenges I'm going to be trying to complete right there. So yeah, here are the challenges. One, build a cobblestone generator. Two, build a house. So you expand the island and blah, blah, blah. Um, craft a furnace. There's some of these I can craft right now. Um, so yeah. Um, yeah, let's get started. Okay, sorry, my nose is pretty runny. So I did was, I live in Indiana. Um, well, before I start going about that, let's get ourselves a cobblestone generator. But I guess I'll talk and crap at the same time. But anyways, um, I went to... I had finals, yeah. Okay, I'm, I'm not thinking correctly. Um, I had finals, and what happened was... Let's put that there. And I was been studying for finals, you know, it's finals, everyone knows you have to study for finals and stuff, so... Yeah, that's why I did that. But, I also had... Um, we, after finals was over, which was about Thursday for me, um, what happened was I also had something else I had to go to. Oh no. Um, and I had to go to Iowa for an Armo competition. I think Armo stands for American something math league. Um, I don't remember the rest of it, but, you know, some, American something math league. Um, it's very tough questions. I'm not very good at it because I just don't like going to Armo. Um, I went to Iowa and it was all fun and actually it wasn't really fun. I didn't like it very much. And no one to talk to really. Um but anyways, I went so I was gone there and there was no internet. The bus I was lucky it was it was a Turner bus. I've never heard of those uh, that bus before, but it's a Turner bus apparently. Um but really, um it, they had internet, but the internet was really, really bad. I could not like even open up YouTube or open up the app store. Um and right now I'm looking at my uh, list of stuff here. Try to see what I can find. I don't think. Okay, so let's see. Okay, so let's continue here. So we have cobblestone generator. That's check. Um, so let's see what else is there. Expand island. I, well, technically this is expanding the island, so I'm giving that a check. I'll expand it later, but as for now, let's check. Um, I haven't, craft, I haven't crafted the furnace yet. Make an infinite water source. I've not done that. Uh, let's see, ender pulls. Okay, so none of these right now at the moment I need. Uh, or well, not that I need, but I haven't, I'm not able to do it at the moment. So let's quickly make a furnace and so we can, like, you know, get that off our backs. Um, okay, we don't have enough. Oh, thanks. There we go. <laughs> My nose is running. Um, so, yeah, that's that. So I was in Armo and we got to live in a dormitory. Um, it was fun and stuff. Uh, and yeah, that's, that was all cool and dandy. Um, it was fun. I guess, really, I didn't have anyone to talk to. I'm a... Yeah. <laughs> I'm normally a very, pretty talkative guy. I mean, I like talking. I'm a... I like talking and stuff. And... Well... Uh... I guess I'm gonna talk to you guys about this. I really don't know if I should talk about it. But one of my friends, um, he... Uh, let's see how I'm gonna do. I don't wanna name any names out, but I don't want him to know who I'm talking about either. Um... Let's just say he's... A year older than me. Um... So anyways, he wouldn't, I wouldn't, like, basically he would, wouldn't talk to me as much. I could, I mean, I'm a guy, when I was in 5th uh, grade, or back in elementary school, I was ignored a lot. I wasn't, like, I, I, I had, I had friends, but they were more like, I guess, like, mini friends. I, they could, they would talk to me. It's just not like they hated me or something, it's just that they didn't really want to talk to me. Um, it was just kind of, they'd rather talk to their own friends. And, in 6th grade, you know Harrison, um, I did map on him, map with him once, um, Shipwreck, and we have not finished it because this computer is destroyed. Um, I don't think that series is ending or even yeah continuing anytime soon. But anyways, he like he's he was when he was in middle school, he was very talkative. Um, I wasn't. I was really quiet and stuff. But what happened was he was like, oh, you know, he's friends with this guy who's older than me that I'm talking about. Let's just call him Bob. And I don't think Bob Bob's bad. Bob's is such a cliche name. Let's think of something else. Um. Let's say his name is Pueblo Monte Crisco. No, that that's that's not fair. Um, 
let's just say his name is George. Yeah, George. George would work. Um, so George over here, he was very quiet as well. Uh, pretty quiet, I guess. Kind of quiet. And what happened was, he was Harrison here was friends with this George. Um, and you know I knew George because he lived he lived kind of close to me, but it would be a while. For, it, it would take a while, like maybe a good five minutes driving to his house. But it was it was just you know it was pretty close. But anyways, um, so what happened? So he, he I was friends with George, so you know Harrison just found out about me. And we became pretty good friends, and Harrison right here is the person that made me, you know, become more of a talkative guy, more luckily you know nowadays. Um, and yeah, so that, that's just a little quick. So I became really, you know, I like talking, and I became more, I guess, sociable, I guess. Um, but nonetheless, uh, George here was, was the trip with me. Um, we were always pretty good friends. I was always a third wheel back in elementary school. If I was a friend, I was kind of third wheel. Um, in this, so I, I was talking to Harrison about this yesterday, but um, I was kind of the third wheel. Um, and I that stopped happening when I got to middle school because you know I, I made friends and all bunch of stuff and all that shenanigans. But on this armor trip, Harrison wasn't there because he doesn't like doing math that much, and I don't either. But I, I'm Asian, so you know that's exception. But um, so. Basically, what happened was I was there bored like to death. Oh, there's another um, little challenge we completed here, but I was bored to death, and my nose is really running. Yes, and my nose is really running. But um, I was bored to death, and George here was talking to his, these middle schoolers. We're in high school now, okay? He talked to the middle schoolers more than he did me, which I would have been fine with because I don't if they want to talk. But he kind of made it made it seem like I wasn't wanted, and I can kind of tell when I'm not wanted. Uh, cause I got, I was really used to that back in middle school, um, elementary elementary school. I mean, and look, it's a big tree. Great, take forever to break it down, but it that sets up knowing I wasn't wanted. But of course, I didn't say much about it. Um, I don't like really talking about my feelings too much. Although I am kind of broadcasting it right now to like YouTube, which is like huge. So I guess it doesn't make any sense. But um, so basically, I didn't say anything about it. But the whole ride, I could tell I was not really wanted. Um, I, I still try to be friends with everyone. I mean, they didn't want me, okay. Um, also, I need to get myself to bed. You guys will see why. As many as you know, there's a little problem with Skyblock, where um, you don't get spawned on at the right spot. Like, you get spawned somewhere. So if you die, you get spawned off to the side. Meaning, um, you basically just fall off the world. So I'm gonna set a bed real quick and I'm just gonna sleep in it. Hopefully, hopefully you guys don't mind. But you know, I've done Skyblock before, and I just I that was the only way I could get it to work. As you can see here, I tried doing slash spawn point. I'll show it to you guys actually. That didn't work. So, oh god, oh god, no spell. But anyway, so yeah, that's that. Um, and yeah, it was, it was really a pressing moment. I mean, I didn't I didn't like being the third person very much. So yeah, it was it was kind of painful. Um, I didn't like it, but, you know, I try, keep, I try to stay upbeat about everything, so, you know, whatever, I don't always care, uh, you guys can do whatever you want, but, I tried, you know, I, I still, I tried, I still tried, you know, talking with the group, I mean, I was still, a lot, I, was, I was still talking with them, it was just that little, my, voice in my head that said, Kevin, you're not really wanted, and you can tell, they got to talk to each other, they knew, but I'm just like, well, I mean, I, they did enjoy talking to me, I mean, I, I, what I did was, we were playing a lot of card games in a bus, it was boring, um, but one time we were playing a lot of speed. If you guys know what that is, but we were playing a lot of it, and you know, eventually at one point everyone started getting bored. They, they, they everyone wasn't talking much. So I just had to pipe in, and I, I my mom, parents gave me a pretty good amount of money. I think forty bucks, and I also got another twenty bucks from. Um, it was uh, everyone got twenty bucks to buy their own food if they bring money. So I had a lot of money with me. Um, so what I did is I was like, okay, do. Tournament of speed against um, George. Okay, against George. But George was pretty good at speed. But, um, okay. You know what? Um, there we go. Okay, so, George here. Actually, you know what? I think I've gone enough into detail that George already knows who I'm talking about right now. Um, so I guess I'll tell you from the beginning. George actually lives really close to me. Um, I was trying to keep this um, a little bit quiet about it and not to let anyone know who he was. But I guess it's kind of, I mean, no, you guys want to know who he is, but. If I point it out, you guys will know. Like if I 
go into more detail, you guys will know who I'm talking about. No, not you guys. He will know who I'm talking about. So I'm not going to really. I'm just going to say it. he lives really close to me, right behind me. Um, he's actually yeah, he is actually older than me, but not by a year. But anyways, let's get back to the topic. Anyone who could be George would get a ten dollar free lunch from me. Well, not anyone, but only one person. So if you challenge George and you beat him, you only get one try. You didn't even have to play the anyone else who beat him. It was a bit kind of attorney style. Only two people. We had six people in our group. Um, two of them challenged George. Well, of course, six people including me, and I didn't challenge him because I was the host, I guess. So, they all uh, challenged him. Two people challenged him. First guy beat him, second guy beat him, and now they beat each other. And we recorded it, and it was all fun, and, you know, it was fun and stuff. And I, it was all fine dandy. The guy got, uh, one guy got his $10 free lunch, and it was all nice and stuff. I had a lot of fun. But, anyways, so after that, Really, I mean, I guess it was fun, but really the whole trip, I was in that mood that I knew I wasn't wanted. It was, it was kind of painful. Like, I didn't say anything about it because I don't like talking about it, but it was, it was in, I knew I wasn't wanted, so I didn't want to say anything about it. But it was, it was a very boring trip. Um, of course, I don't, I don't you know, I, 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 I tried to think about the bright side of things, so I didn't pay too much attention to it. So, yeah. Okay, so let's stop talking about the pressing stuff and let's get started. If you guys look at my Facebook and my Twitter, um, you'll notice that I posted a nice little tweet and post, I guess. But it was about oh god, jeez. Oh look, it's not flowing everywhere. Interesting. But anyways, um, I posted this tweet about the 500 subscriber special and what my idea was to be, what was going to, what my idea was going to be for it. So my idea right now at the moment, I've created this poster, um, and you guys can be able to see it because only the winner gets to have it. Um, but we just got to, I don't do it now, but I'll be post. I'm making a video later. But I just want to, you know, talk about why I've been posting and stuff before I do it in the 500 subscriber special video and stuff. So, what's going on is, um, okay, what's going on is I'm I made a poster and I'll sign it. I don't know how I'm going to sign it though. You guys will see what I mean. But basically, what the heck? What's going on? I didn't click a fade, so that's weird. But anyways, um, what's going on is, yeah, try to get all the dirt as I can. Um. I will sign it probably, if I can, I will sign it personally, like, you know, print it out in a nice little thick, it's going to only be as big as paper, you know, I don't have the resources to make a giant poster, probably only be as big as, you know, uh, printer paper, but, nonetheless, um, hello, <laughs> okay, let's not break that, so basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to sign it either using Photoshop, where I'll sign it as best I can to my ability, I'll sign it using, I'll sign, my, luckily, and I'll also sign it my name with my last name. But you guys won't be able to read it because my signature is pretty scrappy. Scrappy's not work. Crappy? I guess that works. Um, but I'll sign using that. Oh, oh god, oh god, oh god. Ow, ow, ow. 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 <laughs> that hurt. Nope. No, you don't. No, you don't. Okay. So, anyways, I'll sign it using Photoshop or anything, and I'll also put your name in it. I, I put to whom? To, and I'll put a line, and I'll sign it. I'll put your name in it in my handwriting. I'll try to imitate my handwriting if I'm doing Photoshop. And yeah, so what are you guys gonna do is you're gonna comment down below in the video, in the 100, 500 subscriber video, not this video, but in that video. And I'll tell you exactly how to comment, what to comment. Um, and you also have a chance to get more comments in, but I'll, I have my, you know that logo I have on here? And, and you know my skin's on it, you know? Um, on my YouTube channel. Well, I've made it so that you'll see there, my skin on there as well, because it'll be on blank white paper, so you can cut it out if you want. And yeah, so basically, uh, you will get, a recognition of winning and I will basically give you the poster. Um I'll sign it. If I can sign it personally, you're gonna have to give me your address, um I'll, and I'll mail it to you. You can give me some other address if you want. I don't know exactly how you get it to work, but if you want if you don't want to if you guys don't want me to if you guys don't want it personally because you don't want to tell me what your address is, I'm fine with that. I mean you know it's you know security, personal reasons. So I won't do anything about it. I'll just Email the file to you, and you guys can just print it out yourself onto your own nice little paper. And I'll sign it myself. Um, if you really want, I I have I have a scanner thing on my printer, like a lot of printers do. Um, I can basically, um, kind of. That's what I was gonna say now. I'm. It's really hard for me to commentate and do some stuff I'm trying to do. I will. Oh yeah, I'll write. I'll print it out, s sign it, put your name on it in my handwriting using a pen, and I'll scan it, and then I'll send it to you. The Quality to be a bit bad because you know when you're scanning something it isn't always perfect, but it'll work. Um, and oh god, and yeah, so you can either you can choose what however you want me to do it. Um, 
And yeah, that's that. Uh, I don't know if I can though. I don't know if I can mail personally to you guys. So that might be a problem. So you guys have to just, you know, stick with me and see how it works. Um, and yeah, so that's that. And Oops. Okay. So yeah, I think that's all I can say at the moment. Uh, yeah, I think that's really about it. So yeah, that's that. And I think that's all we can talk about now. Um, so let's get back to the game. So we have craft furnace. We got that checked. Um, build a platform 24 away from blocks away from the island for mobs to spawn. I'll do that later. Craft nine book, ten bookcases. Um, yeah, maybe I don't know. Oh God. Um, let's see. Oh yeah, no, ten bookcases won't work because it says as of Minecraft one point two, crafting bookcases is only possible if you have Calgon Island, which I'm not going to be able to spawn in. So yeah, make twenty torches. We got. Oh, we can make more. So let's get that done now. We have the resources to make it. What? Oh, I must have actually put it in the stuff. Okay. Well, there we are. Oh, there. Charcoal, I mean. So, yeah, that's that. Um, so that's 500 subscribers special. You guys will get it. Nice little post receipt for me. Uh, I have my, a few words and a note on there. And, could, you know, congratulations for winning. Um, and yeah. Okay, so let's quickly get our oak wood here. And try it out here. There we go. That's 12. Oops, 12 torches here. Then we need 20, so let's wait for this to hook up. Um, how long have I been recording for now? Oh, almost 20 minutes. So I think the video is about to end quite soon. Um, almost 20 minutes. Each video of um, Skyblock will probably be around 20 minutes. If you guys really want longer videos on Skyblock, which I don't really see what's the point of doing that, but if you guys really want to, I will make it longer. Um, but yeah, so that's that. Let's get some more. Oh no. Let's get more, uh, more cobblestone more we're waiting. So, yeah. Okay, let's get started. So, oh yeah, as for Feed the Beast, I figured out how to port forward. I don't, yeah, I don't think I mentioned it, but for a broken router, I figured out how to finally port forward. I won't make a video on it, because, you know, that'll be part of me giving up my IP, which I really don't want to be doing. Um, but what you do is, if you go to Belkin, you go to IP, you enter in your, um, Windows Start, you know, the Start button, enter Command Prompt, or you can enter CMD, okay? The open command prompt. In that command prompt, you see that thing on there. It will say whatever name you assigned your computer in that little arrow. You put IP config like that. Enter and you scroll down. Look for the IPv4. I think that's the right one. You see the IP there? Um, it will say like one. If it's a broken, it's probably one nine two point one six eight point two point one. Probably like that. Take that and copy and paste it in your web browser. So I mean, go to Chrome or Internet Explorer. Ham, <laughs> who uses that anyways? But you go there and you copy paste that. Enter that in. Enter. And it will, what will happen was it'll bring up your um bring up your thingy my bobber. Yes, your thingy my bobber. Uh I can't think of, I'm trying to okay. It'll bring up a private thing that's only for your computer. And what you're gonna do is um twenty torches, check. Okay. Achievement git. Anyways. You open up there and you you'll see where it says virtual service. Click that. Um if this is your first time you've gone on there, it'll say ask for password. Don't put any password, just click enter or confirm or whatever it says. And it automatically just go put you in, and it bring up this list of whole bunch of servers on there. On the server name, put Minecraft, Minecraft World Two, whatever you want to name it. Okay, and there. Okay, so then basically go on YouTube, go on any videos you want, um, and search up how to port forward a broken router. Everything is correct except one point. So you put in port two five five six five, um, port end or whatever it says two five five six five. But then, and then you put in whatever, 192.1, whatever it says on there. Go on, just go on YouTube and search it yourself, I'll, and you will be able to find it. But the only thing, where it says UDP or TCP, instead of making two worlds, you're going to choose UDP and, and, where's the and, and, and TCP, like that. Click that, and you only have to make one. Only have to make one, okay, instead of making two. And what you're going to do is you're just going to make one, and then you're going to, uh, um, put them all together. Actually, no, let's not use the bit. I, I cheat, I cheated at it, so we're not going to use the bit. But, um, you only use one, it's just UDP and TCP, um, and, yeah, I think I will, I might be able to make a video, I'll just, you know, bleep out wherever it says my IP, um, but I will make, I guess I will make a video, I'll just have to see about it, but explain how you port forward a Belkin router, and you'll be able to create whatever Minecraft server you want. But basically, what, am I try what I'm trying to go here is that I figured out how to port forward, that means a feed to b server might be coming up soon for me and Harrison, once Harrison's computer gets fixed, um, hopefully he can get a new one, but... Hopefully, when this computer gets fixed, we can play some Feed the Beast, and we can play a multiplayer Feed the Beast server. So, you guys will have another series coming up with you guys, and that's that. Um, so, I think that's really about it. That's all we have got for today. We completed one, no wait, one here. 
the torches two and three. So three achievements. Um, I guess we'll head for more later. Um, in the next video. And yeah, guys, I think that's about it. If you did enjoy this video, please remember to leave a like and subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. Um, and please remember to follow my Twitter and check out my Facebook. Um, link will be in the description below. And so with the link to this map be in the description below as well. So anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all later. Bye.